Hi teachers, um, this quick video is going to show you one other way that you can quickly share your screen with students but then at the same time still be able to see your Google Meet. So you can um, resize your windows, log into two devices, hook up two screens, um, but we can also use the tab resize. So what we're going to do first is we're going to have our Meet open and then to the right of the Meet you would want whatever tab has the content you want to show students. So I'm going to actually be in one of my Google Classrooms. Okay, so I want to be able to show them some things in Google Classroom while I'm meeting with them. So I'm going to come over to my tab resize. And when I select tab resize, I'll see little pictures so that I quickly know what content is going to display. So notice that it's not grabbing my tab to the left. It's going to grab my tab from the current tab I'm on and everything to the right. So if I did a two by two, I'd have hangouts classroom blank blank. Two by one, hangouts classroom. One by two, hangouts classroom or meet classroom, sorry. And then one by one would just be meet. So I'm going to select the one by two and it's going to quickly split my tabs. You notice that my classroom is now in its own window. So I'm gonna go ahead and click back on my meet. Um, this does work great if you have um, the grid view on as well. Your grids will just get smaller, but you should still be able to see all of your students. So. Now, I'm going to go ahead and click present now, and I'm not going to present my entire screen because I don't want them to see my meet window as well. I just want them to see a window, and I'm going to select the tab for the window that they're going to see, and I'm going to click share. Okay, so now it's presenting this window here, over here. If I include myself in the grid or change what I see here, I can present. Then I can also make sure that I can still see my students. The one little change is your window is only going to appear as big as you have it. So if you need to make this a little bit smaller and this a little bit larger, you can do that. So that way, if I click on what's presenting, you'll notice how it's skinnier. So, but that way you can still see everything going on at once. 